Uh, eight years ago, I uh, stumbled across a very talented individual by the name of Igor Perich, uh, who had solved some of the problems that we were looking to solve, uh, and we began working with one another. Uh, Igor began working for and became a partner in our business, and we were looking to expand our talent pool uh, internationally and open an office overseas. Um, I asked Igor whether we should pick one of the European Union countries or possibly where he originally hailed from in Bosnia. He immediately and without hesitation suggested we look at Bosnia, and we decided to do precisely that. Um, as part of that process, we engaged in a review of the technical resources that would be available to us initially in order to fulfill our business objectives, and we were blown away by the quality of the talent, both in terms of their ethics, uh, their, their work ethic overall, and their technical ability. And therefore, we moved forward with building that office. And when it comes to being an entrepreneur, what have you seen as difficulties in Bosnia for starting a business and becoming an entrepreneur? I think that there's a, a limited bureaucratic hurdle associated with founding a business and, and making sure that it's properly constituted and, and, um, and well-founded. However, uh, that said, uh, I think that there is no end of talent and ideas in Bosnia. And you know, I've seen folks who I've encouraged personally, independent of our organization, to pursue uh, their entrepreneurial spirit and to, to take their drive and ideas to the next level in Bosnia. And if you could say anything to young people or people who are thinking of being entrepreneurs here in Bosnia, what are the things that you think they should be working towards and doing? Well, first and foremost, I think that the, the talent pool in, in Bosnia uh, benefits dramatically from the level of core education. Uh, the technical education that we've seen in Bosnia far surpasses much of what we've seen in the rest of the world. Uh, what I would encourage entrepreneurs to focus on is a couple of things. The first is, don't ever give up. Failure is absolutely part of the process when you're trying to perform any activity, and certainly in, in high tech, it's no different than that. I failed a thousand times before I succeeded once, and so to the extent that you never give up, you will eventually hit that goal, you'll hit that objective. Uh, the second thing that I would suggest to folks is that they constantly look to network, learn new languages, and integrate with other people who might benefit what they're trying to accomplish. Because the more you communicate, the more you come across people that you want to work with for the rest of your life, just like I have with Igor.